Throughout pregnancy, women may encounter different illnesses or pains and wonder what medication can they take. And this week's Parenting and Pregnancy, we take a look at what medications are safe and which ones to avoid. And this story was shot back in February before the coronavirus pandemic. One of the first symptoms of being pregnant is morning sickness. But don't let the name fool you. Nausea can hit in the morning, the evening, or all day. First thing I always recommend um, for nausea is vitamin B6. Generally, it's taken as a preventative um, three times a day medication rather than just with symptoms. Women may also encounter colds throughout their pregnancy. Dr. Herman says most over-the-counter medications are still safe to take. One important thing to remember is that in pregnancy, the, the cold will typically be a little more severe, last a little longer, um, and, and even just stuffy nose um, that's not from the cold, uh, potentially from allergies here in, in uh, Eugene and, and the Valley, um, are, are going to cause those same symptoms. And decongestants are, are considered safe in pregnancy. We usually, again, less is more, the, the fewer the better. Cough drops, Tylenol, and nasal sprays are just fine. However, other medications such as Coumadin, Warfarin, some anticonvulsants, and ibuprofen should be avoided as they could impact organ development early in pregnancy or circulation later on. When it comes to the flu, pregnant women are encouraged even more than the general public to get the flu shot to protect or lessen the effect of the flu. Medications such as Tamiflu may be prescribed if a pregnant woman gets the flu or has a family member that gets the flu. As, uh, as a general rule and a general philosophy um, regarding medications and pregnancy, we, we, our, our goal is, is to avoid as many as possible. Dr. Herman says everything is dose dependent and patients should always ask their OBGYN if they can continue medications or take new ones during pregnancy. Women's Care also has a 24-7 nursing line for patients to ask any questions regarding safe medication.